Hello guys, welcome to Mirian TV. This is Mirian. Well, najo mmeshanga sana nimekoa wapi with the updates. I promised you guys that I'm going to come back with the updates. So, niko hapa and if you don't know what I'm talking about, let me just fill you in a little bit. I was here with Amos in my previous interview. If you haven't watched, I'm going to link it here or you can just go and watch, see what has been happening. So, you are with him and of course we are trying to ask him a few things of what happened, you know, between him and uh, Director J. Moha, you know and uh, the wife so he explained to us and uh, from what we spoke i referred him to this uh, amazing couple that i know which are the alluders and uh, the reason why I, I referred him to this couple is because i've known them for a long time and it's a good couple so i knew they are going to give him guidance and uh, so from there for me to know what happened but today and we are here with him let him tell us what transpired was the you know uh here meeting now was it successful so he is here i'm just going to welcome him amos yes hi hi karibu sana asante uh salamia hapo watu wa mirian tv okay. hi guys amos here okay so so, so amos Yes. Uh, I know my audience so I'm working with you for a long time because we were here with you the other time and I was so glad that uh, you know you accepted to speak to the Aluda's couple. Yes. So, kutoka hapo mimi sijui kumenda aje but I'm so glad to call nawe hapa maybe you can tell us so how was the meeting and how did everything go? I hope kulikuwa vizuri. Yeah, actually uh, I like the couple. Mm -hmm. We were they came we have a length discussion mm -hmm. na actually i learned a lot from them mm -hmm. na i gave up i gave uh, out my story mm -hmm. nikawaambia according to the questions walikuwa so wananiuliza mm -hmm. from where issue ilikuwa nikawaambia uh, about my past history nikawaambia mm -hmm. ni wapi kwenye tulikuwa na issue ya this issue ya nimekuwa kila wakati nasikia watu wakiongelea mm -hmm. i think walipata hiyo information mm -hmm. na nilifurahia actually nimesoma mingi sana mm -hmm. yes okay yeah. and actually guys i just forgot if you haven't watched that interview or rather here you know table meeting i'm going to link the video down below you can just go and follow up how it went down sasa sijui how could you say the how was the end of it did you learn something from you know speaking with them ama yeah actually mm -hmm. the way to liongea now niliona they, they are making sense mm -hmm. kuna vitu zenye nilikuwa naona on my side mm -hmm. nikaona ya kwamba i didn't do it right mm -hmm. na Actually for now mm. uh, kuna mambo mengi yenye nimechifunza yenye najua nitaifanya nita follow up nitaangalia mm -hmm. but kuna mahali kwenye siku wa na wao mm. ile story yenye tulifika actually the, the discussion ilikuwa sawa mm -hmm. maswali mwanzo ilikuwa sawa ikauliza about the wife mm -hmm. about my businesses everything ilikuwa vizuri lakini kuna mahali kwenye mimi sikufurahia mm. because wanakuja wanaanza kuleta issue ya kina that i need to apologize to the director mm. moha mm. shalin mm. sijui my wife sijui ken mm. so hiyo issue mimi sikufurahia kwa sababu niwezi <laughs> apologize kwa hao watu na those people are the one who are supposed to apologize to me because kulingana na hiyo story venye kunaenda kuwekwa ndani ku, mm. kukuja kukuwa accused false, falsely so actually hapo ndio atuku kupaliana na wao kabisa yeah but any other discussion yeah tulikuwa sawa mm. yes so umesema hamu kukubaliana kwa nini kwa kwa apology okay wewe mbona mbona una find it hard ku kunini ku ask for that uh, for the apology from moha the director jean how the involved parties actually mm. kutokana na na story ya moha mm -hmm. moha alikuwa ameni accuse falsely amekuja kwa hii nyumba mimi nilikuwa nimemuita mm. kuna mambo nilikuwa nataka tuongee naye lakini kulingana na hiyo discussion sikuona kama ameni tumeendelea vizuri alivuka mipaka kwenda kuuliza mambo yenye ayo akustahili kuuliza mm. for kwa hiyo nitakana yeye angekuwa yeye ndiye anastahili kuniomba msamaha mm. then the director 
kwa sababu alikuja ni kuna video naweza yanga watu wanaweza angalia nilikuja nika akanirukia mangumi nini akaniweka ndani mm -hmm. na actually mimi sikuwa nimehusika mahali popote so is the boss no supposed to apologize to me and my wife ile story yenye nimewaelezea kuna vitu zenye zimechificha kabisa wale watu wenye wajua akienda kwa hiyo interview atapata hiyo story mm -hmm. actually she's the one who supposed to apologize to me so mm -hmm. mimi sioni hao watu wote kwenye mimi nakupaliana mahali kwenye nitakana ni apologize wao ndio actually mimi ndio kila mtu anatakana ni apologize kwangu. Okay. Uh, so Amos, uh, you know mimi nilikuwa nime interest the Aluda sana. Unataka uniambie ni kama did my nini thinking ili fail the Aludas kwa kwa sawa. Mm -hmm. But nimekuambia kuna place yenye siku wa na after nimekuambia mapema ile story ya ku apologize mm -hmm. kuna tena walikuwa wanasema at mimi niko violent. Mm -hmm. Sijui na treat my wife sijui kama alafu hii story wanasema mbona na watu wanasema ama nasema kwamba na treat my wife mm -hmm. kama property mm -hmm. na, mimi najua kwamba mimi sina ubaya wote mimi nilipeleka mahari mm -hmm. nikapeleka kwa wife nikalipa nikachukua so it's it's my responsibility to take care of her. So that's why nilikuwa na maanisha si kusema property as in inakaa pale pale lakini nasema kwa sababu mm. ni jukumu langu mm. ku take care of her. Okay. Yes. So hapo ndio watu kwa tunaexcusana na wao. Mm -hmm. Hapo ndio niliona mm. walivuka mpaka ndio but hiyo story nyingine mm. ilikuwa sawa. Okay. Yes. Na so kwa hivyo uh, bibi yako mwenyewe alipatikana amepatikana ama what is the progress? Mimi personally najua my wife wako na my brother in law. Mm. Na nacharibu kabisa juu hii story ya kupotea kwa wife ya director mm. actually imesimamisha hiyo hizo story juu tulikuwa nataka tuongee na yeye juu yeye akiongea na my brother in law mm. atamsikiza. Mm -hmm. But mimi najua my wife wako kule. Mm. Na the same reason nilikuwa nimeambia the Luda because niliona kama wako na kidele mbele wana yeza tembea waka waka mtafuta mm -hmm. waende wa muulize kwa sababu kuna story yenye nilikuwa nimeelezea actually mm -hmm. watu wanaweza kusema nilikuwa na danganya mm -hmm. lakini nilikuwa nimewambia waende watafute my wife mm -hmm. e, wakimpata wa muulize hiyo maswali ili yeye pia toe story mm -hmm. e, atkuje ku, kuongea mm -hmm. ili watu wajue ukweli na nikawaambia sitarudi kukaa na wao tena ku discuss anything mm -hmm. unless wameenda wame unless wameenda pale wamepata my wife mm -hmm. wamekuja na yeye tukaye kwa mesa to discuss pamoja mm -hmm. ili ile accusation ama ile yenye story niliwaambia mm -hmm. e, wa, my wife akuje akuja confirm because najua hiyo mm -hmm. story ni mimi peke yangu na wife anajua mm -hmm. so tukiwa wote hapo uh, kwa around the table mm -hmm. to be discuss actually mm -hmm. ukweli itachulikana mm -hmm. yes so sasa hizi tuseme publicly mbele ya kamera umekubali kwamba the alludas waki kuja na your wife ama wakimtafuta ama wakimlocate you are willing to catch ni mu discuss his issues very true very true uh -huh. because mimi pia nataka to sort issue once and for all uh -huh. because hii story imekuja nimekuwa accused to one side it uh -huh. so tukikuja tukae hapo na kila mtu afunguke awaseme ukweli wenye mimi nilifunguka nikasema ukweli mm -hmm. then watu watajua shida iko wapi mm -hmm. then sasa kutoka pale tutajua uh, kama tutaenda which direction okay. yeah but for now mm -hmm. nimewapea time mm -hmm. wao waende waangalie wenye nimekuambia niliwaona kwamba wako na mambo haraka haraka so nikasema mm -hmm. waje wao waende watafute wife mm -hmm. na kuje so hivyo ime ilifika tu hapo. Mm. Ya. Yeah. Lakini sasa juu pia mimi nataka hii kitu lazima nataka mkae muongee. Hata mimi nitasaidia na I'm really hoping that tutamtafuta tunampata. Umesema currently bado ako ako at your at his, her brother's place. Yes, exactly. Sawa sawa. Mm. Really work hand in hand na nitawa inform na ninajua hata hii video wataiona. Yes. So let's trust that hii lazima tukazane so that muongee lazima tupate solution venye mimi nilikuwa nimepromise earlier. So